This is code.org. Let's see what we're working on. Use the counter variable twice to solve this puzzle. Twice. Okay. So we're using it twice. That means, though, we're not making it twice, maybe? We're not declaring it twice, which you usually wouldn't do with a variable. That's beside the point. Let's do this. All right. This stuff can be tricky. So we know that we're going to use counter, but at first, I just want to see what we're doing. So I'm going to start laying out code. I know we need less than 11 blocks. It's really hard to picture sometimes what you need to do. So let's see. I know move forward, get some nectar. We're going to move forward not once, but twice. Ooh, tricky. And then, hey, we're getting two nectar also that time. Get one nectar, get two nectar, okay? Then what? We're going to move forward one, two, three, sure. One, two, three, that's a lot. We're going to get nectar three times. Oh, hey, I'm noticing a pattern here, which is good. Patterns in code mean there's probably an easier way. All right, so this and this. I move forward once, I get one nectar. I move forward twice, I get two nectars. I move forward three times, I get three nectars. So, hmm, what could we use that we have been using? Well, we could use the counter pattern, right? Or the for loop. Here we are with our for loop. Right? Now, what would I want these numbers to be though? Now that's tricky. I need to move forward, well, how many times? One, two, three, four, five, six times. Okay, what are these numbers though? One, two, and three. So I need to get nectar one, two, and three. So let's start with that. And then, if I need to get nectar one, two, three times, and I need to, Okay, let's start then. How many times do I need to move forward? Well, once, twice, three times, right? Once, twice. What if we do a four, um, a repeat times loop? Okay, but instead of saying times, we put counter here because I already know how many times do I want to move forward? Once, and what I'm asking to start with, one. So at first, counter is going to be equal to one, and we could run this. And we could do a move forward. It will move forward. It will say, okay, repeat counter times. Counter's one. Great. I'm going to move forward. Boop. Hit the bottom. I have run this one time. Go down here. Boop. Oh, I got to do this. Uh, okay, so I'm at one. I'm going to three. Awesome. So now count by one. So I'm at two. And count times. Okay, so two. So I need to move forward two more times. And I would go here and here. Once twice boom hits the bottom because it's now done twice and goes back and does this again let's see if we can at least get through the to the end flower like this see if we're on the right path okay so we are well that means then if it works for the forward i move forward one how much nectar one i move forward one two how much nectar two i move forward three how much nectar so if this four if this counter works for the forward, it should work for our nectar. But first, I'm going to do something wrong because this is super tricky. This doesn't work. And here's why. There's no nectar right here. So I, the first time it works great, I move forward and I get one nectar, right? Here, let's step through it. I move forward. I get one nectar. That's the end because counter started at one. Repeat one time. That's my one time. Zoop. And I go back to the top. Counter is now, count by once, and counter is now two. Repeat two times. I move forward once, boom, and then I get nectar, but I'm not at the flower yet. I can't get nectar. This is my two step away, which is why the hint, we're going to use counter twice. So what if we do this and separate them out, which lets both of them complete their repeat loops using what the for counter, using our variable counter, is equal to. This one is tricky. Boom. Awesome. Onward. And if you're not getting this, go back and watch this tutorial. Go back and redo the other parts of this lesson. This stuff is difficult. You'll be happy that you are understanding it now as opposed to in the future when it's going to be needed for game making and all that cool stuff.